Okay, so I just got an editing and I'm uploading the uh, August 5th delivery video. And today is uh, August 8th, so it's Saturday. That was Wednesday. Uh, it's like 4.35, so it's later than I wanted to be, but I wanted to, like, I wanted to get this like up and going before I go. I'm about to head downtown and uh, do some deliveries. And I'll, I don't know if Tyson all over there is too happy about it. You happy, buddy? But, uh, I noticed, too, that, like, when I'm behind the camera, the mic's picking up really good. Maybe because I'm, like, right over it. But when, like, I'm in front of it, it doesn't pick it up as good, so. I mean, I kind of messed with it a little bit in the editing software to try to kind of even things out. And I messed with some of the settings, too. But I may actually look into, at some point, getting that, maybe getting that wire, uh, Rode Wireless Video Go thing. But I don't know, like, if I just want to... I'd have to, like, stick it on there and then, like, plug it in then have the thing on me and I have to, like, take it on and off when I'm getting ready to use it or not. So, I don't know. I'm trying to, like, make it as easy as I can. I am tired, though. Because I was going to go out last night, Friday. But I was, like, I just... Like, I got ready. Then I just, like, went to bed. I was, like, I'm just... Because I work early in the morning. So I'm trying to do this in the afternoon and at night. And it's... That I can't really sleep a lot at night or during the day, so I don't know. I gotta figure something out, but because I'm contemplating doing this full time or instead of my job, because I can technically make more money if I go at it, but it's ever changing too with whether the day is busy or not, and how I would do it during the winter or just go full tilt during the summer, and then save up a bunch of money. So I wouldn't have to do it during the winter or not. I don't know. But uh, let's get downtown and get some deliveries going. And I'll try to see how I can do this. Because I think that one, that previous video I just put up was like, it's like 23 minutes. So I'm trying to, I need to figure out a way to like still get the information in there. But like shorten it to maybe like 10 or 12. So it's watchable. I don't know, do you guys want to watch a 23 minute video or like a 10 to 12 is better? Or just whatever works, works. But yeah, I gotta finish getting my stuff ready on the bike and fill up the water, then we'll go. It's like 83 degrees, so it's kinda hot, but not super hot. So, I almost need like a coffee or something, I don't know. Alright, let's go. Alright, so it is, uh, it's like 5.46, I just got down here, so I got down here like 45 minutes later. That I would like to, but if we look at the uh, actual map here, we can see that it's, it's pretty busy. So I haven't logged in yet, so I'll uh, I'll log in, and uh, then we'll see if anything pops up. All right, so we'll hit go, and uh, I'm online. And like normal, I'll probably go uh because i'm in goodell park right now as you can probably maybe maybe see i just come here as like a beginning point or whatever but uh i'll uh go out of here and then i'll probably head north a little bit towards more of the center of that towards uh osu and all that and uh, we'll uh, see if uh, when any orders come in or whatever. So let's get going. So the uh, first one came in. It was pretty quick after I left. It was a Chipotle. That was good in. Pretty easy. A lot of times too, if you get enough orders, especially with the Chipotle, they'll. Uh, They'll stack the orders. If you're on a bike, they'll give you like a, they'll give you like two orders to go or something like that, so they can like stack you up. But usually, anything that's like just a, a food item, that's like a brown bag, that can just kind of set in here, is like really nice and easy. So I'm gonna get ready to take that. So it is. Roughly 
I did a few deliveries. I didn't get a tip on the first one, and we'll see what the other ones are when they roll in. Uh, so it's at 36 right now. It'll probably be a little bit more when I get there. Uh, I mean, it's busy now. It's just it's like 8:30. It's starting to get dark. I actually did uh, log out. I mean, I did a. I mean, I did what? I said six or something like that. It's like two and a half hours. I, I don't know. I just don't like. I'm sure there's tons of orders coming in. And I could stay out and do it, but I'm just. I kind of don't really feel like it. I mean, I was at work this morning, so I got there at like uh, four or something. So I've been up all day. And normally I would. But I don't know. I've seen dogs around and stuff. I didn't film as much as I have before because I don't want to film just putting something in the bag and that's it. Also, I was wanting to see if I can grab some photos too, like the uh, the sunset and stuff here. If I can get some of that. But I don't know, I mean, like it's definitely busy, but I just kind of getting tired of doing like late night stuff. So I think I'm just, I may just head home. Well, I'm gonna see if I can get a couple of photos, but I may just head home and play with Tyson and need some food. Then it's starting to get like darker and darker earlier. Like in June, obviously it was like 9 p.m. And now it's already getting dark around 8.30. It's gonna keep getting darker and darker sooner and sooner. And I kind of want to, they still have five to nine as the peak time, but I kind of want to get away from being out late and see if I can uh yeah a tip just came in but uh try to maybe start doing more around the lunch time thing or whatever because I got uh I got two Amazon packages too one of them's like kind of a cup holder thing because I had to do a fountain drink at Popeyes and luckily yeah uh, I used this uh it's like a Corona. Uh, I can't see. It's like a Corona six pack that I have. Fold it up. I use that and it works. I mean it. I mean it, it, it gets you by. If you don't have anything, you can go grab like a six pack beer thing. It'll get you by. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm just not feeling it. Maybe I'll try to come out earlier tomorrow or something Monday they have like a, I was complaining about the boost not being that much but for some reason Monday like all day long has like higher boost than today Saturday or tomorrow Sunday I don't know why but uh yeah well see, I don't know if I want to keep doing these every single time I go out and uh if they're the same thing or not I don't know but yeah I'm just I, I don't I'm just like I just feel it's not even physical. Well, it's kind of physical. I've like physically and mentally out of it. It's so, like this whole week, I've been debating between keeping the one job or just doing this full time because this would technically make more if everything goes right. But you never know. So that's kind of trying to figure that. <clears throat> trying to figure that out. It's giving me like uh, it's giving me like anxiety for the last few days. I think that's a big factor in it too. Yeah, I don't know. Well, uh, I'll see if I can grab some shots. It may have gotten too dark by now, me talking. But yeah, I think, uh, maybe that 11 to 22 might be nice because I can keep it close like this and it'll be a lot wider. I don't know. I think it was like three or four hundred bucks, but, uh, I mean, I could technically stay here and make. I could probably get close to a hundred if I stay till like midnight, but I just, like I said, I'm out of it. I just. I don't feel like it. I don't know. Alright, so uh, we'll reconvene when I get home. I will say that uh, I used to come down here a lot just for photos. I would spend pretty much all day, like multiple hours, taking photos of. Uh, 
taking photos of stuff. So that's kind of, I think it's part of it too, that I have this camera I can actually bring this lightweight enough with me that I kind of want to do it during the day, like the last hour of sunset, like stop doing deliveries. and kind of want to go around and take photos again. Then from those photos, start creating paintings again. Because this is like way off subject, but I was talking about doing, you know, the warehouse job or this. But I, I don't want to do either one of them long term. So, just, I don't, just thinking about, I guess, I mean, I have the art thing too, and YouTube I'm trying to get to take off. I mean, even if I can get like, but that's not even really like reliable as well, the YouTube shit. You can say a bad word and your whole career, everything you work for gets kinked tanked unless I'd like really delve back into the art stuff again like the oil landscape paintings that I do and just essentially like really up the price so it's worth the time I spend to put into it instead of doing small ones for like 100 I'll do small ones like for like 400 so it makes it worth the time materials and all that stuff <clears throat> I put into it. This is just a good. This could be a good thumbnail. Like. There we go. There we go. Could be a good thumbnail. But uh, yeah, I was grabbing a few shots because you can get the uh, the sun setting in the west gives you all those nice oranges and hot pinks and stuff then of course you got like all the light hitting back over here creating that wonderful cavalcade of images but yeah I may like see if I can grab a few more than head home <clears throat> like I said I definitely could I definitely could stay out and probably make a hundred easily I just I, I don't I, I'm like I'm not really feeling it which is one benefit I thought about Uber Eats and like Postmates have like you work when you want to then when you don't want to you don't have to you don't have a set schedule to work but but then again there is that fear if you're if that's like your only income that'd be your fear like you'd work like non-stop all the time I would think at least you have like some kind of savings built up with like a couple of months worth so I don't know the sky is pretty Sky's pretty. Yeah, so. Alright, now now let's reconvene at home again. Hell yeah, maybe I should have came. Oh, I didn't even realize there's lights here. All kinds of lights. There's like some construction going on down here too. Maybe I should have came here. Uh, a little bit ago. But yeah, I'm gonna grab some shots of this. Can we can we auto balance the No. I bet if I zoom in we can. There we go. That's kinda what I'm seeing. Grab some shots of this. And this is like right at uh Goodell where it connects to the I think I'm not sure what apartments those are, but the buildings and new ones over here, I think those are called The Reach. So, I'm gonna grab some more. This is turning more into a photo vlog than his Uber Eats, but whatever. Is Buddy excited to see me? You wanna be in the vlog? Well, hold on. Hold your fucking horses. Come here. Or drink some water too. I wasn't gone that long. Oh yeah, it is a. Uh, it's uh. Is it 10:30? I went and got some groceries as well. Uh, if you're wanting to get some really good pizza at a pretty good price, uh, freschetta four cheese, that naturally rising crust. 
This stuff is really good. Are you thirsty? Are you super thirsty? Anyway, so I just got home. Uh, I got some stuff here from Amazon. I got like a drink carrier thing and a uh, bungee cord rack for when I get my uh, front uh, front uh, uh, front rack. There we go. I was just trying to think. So looking at the. Uh, Earnings here. The last person didn't tip, I'm thinking. So, uh, give me a second here. Will you shut up? What are you whining about? What are you whining about, huh? Look at me. So, anyway, uh, so I made like, if we can focus here. Come on, Cannon, you can do it. Right here. There we go. So, uh, we made uh, 17 net fare, 1185 promotions, and 1275 tip for a total of 4163. Like I said, I could have probably stayed out there and made close to 100 if I wanted to, but it's, I just wasn't feeling it. Uh, yeah, I'm getting tired of being out there late, like I said. What else was I going to do? I got the pizza. I got home. The last person didn't tip. First person didn't tip either. I mean, they're not all going to tip, but... I don't know. Because I didn't go out... I didn't go out last night either because I just wasn't feeling it. I figured I'd have to do it today. <clears throat> so I did. And uh, I think that's it. I'm, I, I feel like there's something else I was going to talk about. But the money, the pizza, check. I Obviously I'm not sponsored, but that stuff is good. Check it out. Oh yeah, I got some uh, flour. I got some, uh, this has turned into something else, but some of these, like, Goya, Golden Maria, uh, cookies. They're, like, 99 cent, but they taste like the Milano milk chocolate cookies. They're, like, really good. They're very, very tasty. I was kind of being late, because I was trying to figure out how to put this. I was trying to carry it on the rack here and bungee it and it didn't really work out in case I got like a pizza or something like that or if I was just wanting to put the food in the... But we got this... I don't know, I may make a separate video on this or when I get it. Because it's like a multi-drink... It's almost like a big insulated thing with like drink Velcro strap carriers. So I got it, and I was going to see if maybe it would fit. It's dimensions are maybe a little bit bigger than this, so I was going to see if it would fit in here. But I'm thinking, with that front rack coming, I may actually put the front rack on, then set that on the front. And then probably could do a lot, a majority of the, if I get like just one bag and one fountain drink, I can probably just sit it, granted everything works out the way it's supposed to, set it, in that thing on the front rack. The thing is though, uh, that front rack is not going to get here until like the 20th of August and today's the, what the hell's the day? The 8th maybe? Yeah, today's the 8th. So, because I'm used to like Amazon, like I bought it on Amazon, I'm used to like Amazon where it's like next day or whatever, but it's like, I could have paid like an extra 20 bucks to get it here by the 13th or something like that. I'm like, I don't want to do that. But, that's kind of my plan is to get like a front rack. So I'm not, I'm thinking it's going to, it has like a, it hooks to the, the eyelids down here. Then it goes up and it's, it's the originate, so it goes up here. 
then it has like a thing that like sits back here so I think I have to take like the calipers off and take like that spacer take one of those spacers out to get it in there and it's like a flat rack and it has like a little thing but I'm not sure how high up it's going to be and how big that is but I got an orange cargo net to match the orange trims I think about getting the blue probably said a couple times with like the blue petals and the the cooler bag thing I got was blue as well so it could be if that works out super good like most of my stuff would be on the front but still I could have that for the pizzas and whether that fits in one of those or not I don't know I just gotta play around uh, with it try to get it set up make like the ultimate food delivery bicycle or whatever which technically it'd probably be an adventure bike or gravel bike or cyclocross and not necessarily just a straight road bike but I'm working with what I got so if I get a new bike I got to get one that's like a touring bike it's something where it has like all the like different mounts and bolts and hooks and all that stuff and maybe a little bit thicker tires, 28s or 32s. I don't know. But yeah, I think that's, uh, I still have a Christmas tree up. Uh, I think that is it for tonight. Uh, if you like this, uh, give me a like. If you really like it, you can subscribe. Comment. I kind of want to continue. The AC just kicked on. I kind of want to continue making these, but I don't know if I want to make them every time I go out. I feel like if I... I kind of feel like it'd get dull if I do like the same thing over and over again. So if you have any suggestions, or maybe there's like, I can make, when I'm out, I can make a video about like one specific aspect of it that day or something like that. Like using those Bushwhacker Omaha uh, grocery pannier bags or something like that. Or make a video with the whole bike build up or something. I don't know. Just let me know in the comments and we'll see. I don't know, maybe if I get busy doing stuff, I won't even film. Because i got to figure out a better way to like not have it in my backpack. i got to figure out, i got to like strap it on somewhere or something so I can just pull it out quickly. That's the whole point of getting it, so I can just pull it out quickly instead of digging through my backpack to get the bag out of the bag. But I've ranted again, and this one may be long again, so. Alright, later.